Hey guys, so it's been like, oh, it's been a few days since I've vlogged, but I kind of took a break from vlogging because I have so much content that I have to get out and pushed out. So I have like probably two weeks worth of content. So you guys won't even see this vlog for like a couple weeks from when I'm recording it. So I want to take a little bit of a break. Um, and then I did want to share a little couple changes. So I was doing like keto or whatnot. But I decided, okay, so keto is getting into ketosis, eating high fatty foods. And I decided, okay, I don't want to do keto, but just a lower carb. And I kind of have been doing a little crappy, I will say, lately. But tonight, tonight's dinner, it's actually... It's actually 4.50 right now. I don't think you can... It's like really bright. It's 4.50 right now anyways. So I'm going to kind of start prepping dinner. Willie's hunting, so I don't even know if he'll be home for dinner. Um, but I'm gonna do cheese stuffed meatballs, which I'm really excited for. I have the ground beef, it's thawed out, and I'm gonna mix stuff in that, whatever, and then stuff it. I have string cheese, and I'm gonna like cut those up and stuff those inside. And yeah, I just think it's gonna be really good. I'm like so excited. So, yeah. So instead of keto, I'm like, I want to call myself more low carb because, like, lower carb. Like, I don't know. Because another thing with keto, and I kind of knew this, but I didn't really think too much on it, but as soon as I quit doing keto, you're going to gain the weight right back. So, like, go into ketosis or whatnot. So, And it's not good for your heart, all that fat food, all that fatty food. I mean, for crying out loud, I already drink enough energy drinks every day. So, yeah, I just thought I'd share that. But I'm going to do a time lapse and show you guys how I'm going to make these meatballs. Can't wait. I can make you stay Cause baby I love you Why you tryna break us up When I'm tryna build it up I wish I could make you stop Cause baby I love you Guess I'm gonna dance alone tonight I'm gonna miss your body You know I can never get it right Without you, no I don't wanna step into the light If I don't get you shoddy
ghost Oh, I don't feel right when I dance alone I don't feel right when you don't come home I miss your body and I love you so Baby, I do, baby, I do, oh yeah Come on and give me that, give me that, give me that good, good Good morning, you guys. I just rolled out of bed. It's Saturday morning, 7.03 a.m. I'm getting my coffee made. This coffee maker has been, like, messing up. Like, it won't, it won't. Okay, so I just redid it, redid it, but it only gave me a little bit, and I filled the water way further up. But I just clicked capsule, and I haven't clicked ground because I've been, been doing ground coffee. Um, because I don't have any more of the pods that I like. That's the only one. I don't really like these other ones. They're all, like, flavored. Oh, sorry. Just trying to wake up here. Um, so we'll see how the capsule does. Um, and if I just can't use ground anymore. No, it still didn't do it. I know I have water in here still. Maybe I don't. Let's try it again. I was thinking anyways about going to Walmart, to, oops, about going to Walmart today and just investing in an actual Keurig. It's like $59. Um, this was like 20. Oops, I just get it everywhere. This is like 20 and because it's just the, I don't know how to say the, it's that Walmart brand, the Faberware, Faberware. Um, but you get what you're paying for, apparently. It's annoying because it worked really good for a while. And then all of a sudden it just quit working. So I'll just probably get the, I don't know if I have to clean it, but it just seems kind of like a hassle. But I'm, I'm probably just going to get today, though, Keurig. But anyways, I am, I haven't really vlogged. I vlogged yesterday, me going to get water, and then I was going to vlog more, and I don't know what happened. I, like, spaced it. I totally forgot. But anyways, we went up for dinner last night as a, as a family of four, which we have not done that in a really long time. Like, me and Willie have, like, like, we'll order in, get food to the house, but we haven't, the four of us... Um, we haven't gone out to eat, just the four of us, and like, as with all four of us in a very long time, so it was a nice little dinner. We got some fish, Jack got a burger, Blaine, I was like, I'm just going to share my shrimp with, Willie got fish, I got shrimp. I was like, I'm just going to share my shrimp with Blaine because he doesn't eat, <laughs> like he hardly eats. I'm like, why are we even going to waste money on getting him a meal mode? He can like just mooch off the rest of us, you know, so that's what we did, um, and then I came home, and it was really, really nice, I, so I had a glass of wine, because I also got a Bloody Mary when we were there, but I had a glass of wine, and then I laid in bed, it was like 7 o'clock, and I watched a show on Netflix, it's called Dear Child, it's pretty good actually, I am going to start watching it again here really soon when my coffee gets made, and then I lit a candle, and left it right up here, Smells really good actually. This is 
I don't know. It's something, something good. I don't remember where I, where I even got it, to be honest. Threshold. Oh, that would be Walmart. Not really. Um, I wish Scentsy sold candles because they they have their clean products. I'm sure I can find a candle with clean products. I don't. Walmart's not. Um, and I haven't really talked. I don't know if I've really talked much on my Scentsy stuff. But, um, yeah, I started Scentsy. I did, like, a big party order, and I had, like, a few people actually order for me, and I, I did really good, actually, with this party. I was really happy. I was really surprised. I didn't think that that many people would order. Um, so, yeah, I'm, it's really exciting. I created a Facebook page, um, and that's gonna be another little adventure for me. I actually had a lot of fun doing it. I'm not going to lie. Um, it's kind of a lot of work for not like a whole lot of money, if I'm being honest. But, well, is and isn't because I also got like a lot of free product for doing it in like a party order. So I'm going to do like a big, I did end up getting a website and no one's ordered off of that. That's like $15 a month for me to keep it up. So if any of you guys are interested, I have a website. But I'm going to open up a big party order for, like, people that are local. People that I can, like, go and drop the items off to. Um, and that will save them all on shipping. Um, because I'll just deliver them the items. And it, it helps me to get, like, the party, um, things like the, like, the free items. Um, so yeah, it was... Fun. I'm gonna do a party every single month. I'm gonna also, when I get these free items, I'm gonna get like a certain warmer or certain something every single month. Probably a warmer, maybe maybe other things eventually. Um, I'm also gonna get that and do giveaways, drawings every single month. I think I'm gonna do every party or something. I'm kind of excited for that. That'll be fun. So. It's it'll it's fun. I don't know. It's kind of like I said. It's you don't make a whole lot of money to be honest for um, the amount of work you put in. But I mean, is it really that much work though? I don't know. Okay, I didn't still did not get that much coffee for the amount of water I think I put in. But that's okay. I am going to drink this, and we'll invest in a new one today. I'm gonna go buy one today. So I'm gonna sit down, do some work on my laptop and watch The Dear Child. It's on Netflix. I don't know. It's kind of like, I don't know what you would consider the movie, like suspense or whatever, but it's really good. Okay, so I just got out of the shower and got ready because last minute we decided we're going to go to the zoo. It's like an hour and a half drive, but they're having like a free zoo day and it's like one of the like, I don't know this for sure, but it's probably like one of the biggest zoos in Wisconsin. I don't know. I'm sure it is. Um, it's the Milwaukee Zoo, and so it's an hour and a half drive, they have a free zoo day. The tickets are usually, like, I think they're, like, almost $20, so I'm like, well, what the heck, we got nothing going on, it's funny, like, things are always so last minute and random with, with me, but anyways, I'm gonna start my crock pot dinner for tonight before we head on out of here to the zoo. I'm gonna do barbecue pork ribs. I think I've shared this before with you guys I don't know I think I have it's super easy um, I'm just gonna peel this there's a well there's the plastics on it but there's like a white layer on here that it says to peel off which I did not do last time but they still turn out good but I'm gonna try to peel it off and then anyways the, I cut it in half throw it in the crock pot put some barbecue over this top I might add a like a barbecue rib seasoning that I have up there and then some Dr. Pepper and that's it and then it cooks for eight hours. I don't know, seven to eight hours. So that's what I'm about to do. Um, I think for the rub, so I have like a barbecue over oh, right here. So I have this dry rub. It's great for beef. Let me smell it. Yeah, this smells really good. I'm gonna add this on top, just just because. So let's get to cooking. Or prepping, I should say. Oh, I should share too. I bought this eggnog. I forgot I had this in the fridge. It's vanilla eggnog from Walmart. I'm pretty sure I gained 10 calories just off, or 10 pounds just off of my one sip. <laughs> so fattening, but it is so good and addicting. I just drank it right from the carton too. So, 
Don't judge me. This is mine. No one else's. Okay, so it said there's like a white layer, but um, this is just the fat. I don't know if that's really... Like, do I really have to take that off? That seems like a... Well, here. Let's see. So, here we go. But I like... I don't know. It says to start it with a knife and then just peel it off with your hands. So let's try. But it's not that easy to come off, mate. It's all slimy. Ugh. We might just read this because I left it last time and honestly, I, it, it seemed fine. I'll just try for a little bit longer. Can't give up that easily, right? Here we go. Maybe. Oh, here we go. Oh, gross. Well, interesting. So I left this on last time. Okay, so that was not that bad actually. So there it is. I don't know what they called it, but oh, weird. Okay. Okay. So then we'll just cut this in half. Let's do like this. Let's place this in the crock pots. Um, oh, I want to put that rub on quick though. Okay, so let's go ahead and put this dry rub on. I don't know if I, I don't think I used this last time. I don't know. Maybe I did. Maybe I didn't. I don't remember. Okay. And there we go. So put that in there. concept of using Dr. Pepper in my food was so odd but it is it really makes it tender it is so freaking good I'm gonna do one more can just because I'm not gonna be home all day so I don't want it to like dry up at all so there we go yeah that's a decent amount of like liquid Wayne don't play with that buddy So we're gonna do low and we're gonna, I'm gonna set it for seven hours um, because then after seven hours it goes on to warm and honestly like even when it's still on warm after it's been cooking all day it's still like it's like cooking kind of so yeah that's why I'm doing that um I can even probably set it at six hours and then oh, I hate this camera sometimes um do it that way but my friend just messaged me. I, we're going with a, one of my friends. Okay, so we're finally back home from the zoo. I am so tired, so I have a Kim made Alani new. This is like my favorite flavor, honestly. But it was a good time. And I'm just tired. <laughs> so I went, stopped at Walmart, playing got a toy, per usual. <laughs> And then I did find the Keurig. It was actually on sale for $49. So that's nice. Um, I kind of was like, I wasn't sure on the color. I did get this blue color. Ah! But I really wasn't sure if I wanted that color, if it would go as well up there. I thought maybe black would be better. Even like the red ah. one. I did like the gray one and I was going to get the gray, but that was $69. So I don't know why it was so much more. So yeah, I'm going to take it out and set it up and see how I like it. Um, but my camera bed is going to die, so I'm going to switch that out and then I'm going to set this up. 
Okay, so here's the ribs. And the tops are kind of burned. They might still taste fine. It smells burnt a little bit. Um, but the uh, side, it's really burnt onto the sides, which is going to be such a pain when I have to clean this. Um, so I'm not really excited for that, but I'm just going to move this over here. Me and Blaine had some... I was just going to try to get the juice on top. So me and Blaine had some Culver's at like 3 o'clock. So I'm like, Blaine didn't really eat that much, but I ate a freaking lot. I had the curd burger, and then I ate some of his freaking kid's meal, and he didn't hardly eat any. I don't know why he wouldn't. And then he also got ice cream. Um, so I am literally, I don't, I will not eat again tonight. I am so stuffed. It's 5.30, so Blaine's going to have to eat dinner, so I'll give him that, obviously. But, um, yeah, so I'm going to set that over there. I'm going to go ahead, set up my new Keurig. Just take this off. like the setup. I don't really like the setup. Um, okay, there it is. I'll just put this away quick. So, hmm, how do we feel? Obviously, this is going to move. Oh, is the leaf touching your head? think do you like it I don't know I really liked the black one there I thought it looked so good and I'm almost wondering if I should have just got a black here I really like the blue color I just don't know Ugh. I don't know I gotta figure it out but I did want to share with you guys I'm gonna turn on my warmer that's like what I got today so I really wanted like a little backpack that I could carry in the zoo because my purse is just over my shoulder. So, you know, it's kind of hard. And I, so I stopped at TJ Maxx and I got this. It's this little guest. Oh, I didn't even take this off. This little guest backpack. I love it actually. Um, and then it worked out good because I could put an extra pair of pants in here for Blaine and some underwear in case he had peed through. So yeah, I just, I like it. I love it. Also, I got home and I was so excited because my thread up boxes came. I ordered um, bulk. I used to do a, this all the time and I haven't really in a while. But I ordered the thread up bulk mixed clothing. I got 100 pounds. So that's two boxes because it's 50 pounds per box. So I'm going to have to go through that and start um, taking photos again. So I'm kind of excited for that. This is like a bad angle. I don't know. I'm doing that um yeah so I'm really excited to go through I don't know if I'm gonna do an unboxing I know that I have viewers on here that do really like the unboxings but I just I don't like doing unboxing videos I I don't know what it is I just cannot stand it I hate doing unboxing videos they drive me nuts um to do them which they're so easy though so I don't really know but yeah so I got these. I'm not gonna even futz with them tonight. Honestly, they are gonna have to wait because I don't feel like messing around with that. Um, yeah, so I think I'm gonna go ahead kind of get my Keurig going. Like, you know, you gotta do a couple cycles and whatnot. Um, okay, so as I was taking the tape off, I kind of realized I don't think I'm gonna keep this because I have to do these dishes. But this is my coffee mug I'm using. That is not gonna look good on there, is it? I mean, it's gonna look so mismatched I feel like let's see yeah it's like just a freaking blue I don't know I <laughs> why is this so difficult I don't know but yeah I'm kind of uh, I'm on the fence if I'm gonna keep it I might actually return it I don't know I'm so on the fence I don't know 